Welcome to this week's episode of Now Loading. I'm Big Ant. I'm Bio Monkey. And I'm Death Vanquished. In the jungle, the mighty jungle, the lion sleeps tonight. <laughs> Idos should be ashamed of themselves. Rape in a video game. It is detestable. Hey, hey, guys, did you see the new gameplay trailer for Tomb Raider? The one from E3? Sure, yeah. Well, don't you find it sick that they are putting rape in a video game? Wait, wait, wait. Did I miss something here? Oh, obviously you did because you're a product of rape culture. You didn't even notice the potential rape in the trailer. Rape culture. That sounds like a conspiracy theory or something. Yeah, I mean, if our culture supports rape, then why do we have rape shield laws that violate the constitutional right of facing your accused? Oh, that's right. Because we need to protect the victim. <laughs> You're just men. You don't understand. Apparently. Get out of my sight. Rape has no place in video game. Mm, oh, okay, well, what about mass murder? Excuse me? What happened to video game journalists like you defending Modern Warfare 2's No Russian mission? Right, didn't you all defend gaming as an art form back then? Stating that if gaming were to grow, that we would have to risk seeing horrible acts of human barbarism? Yeah, I mean, how can you say you want gaming to grow as an art form when you're willing to put limits on what content a game can have? Rape in media is just a cheap trick used to get the audience to feel an emotion for the character without any real character development. Agreed, but that wasn't your point. Hey Paul, come to find out when you fail the contact sensitive section, the guy just throws you on the ground, crushes your trachea, then shoots you in the face! Oh, that's much better then! Is it? Dude, Gearbox just announced that since Borderlands 2 is now in certification, they're going to be focusing on DLC. Well, that's odd. Bio, did you hear that Gearbox is already working on DLC for Borderlands 2? Uh, yeah. Well, what do you think about that? Not a damn thing, because I'm not even going to pick up the main game, let alone any DLC for it. Oh, that's right, you're an idiot. Anyway, do you think it's too soon to announce that they're working on DLC? Is it day one DLC? Well, well no. Then I don't see a problem with it. Okay, right. I mean, the first DLC, the Necromancer, is going to be free anyway, so I'm not bothered at all that they're already working on another DLC. Uh, shouldn't you be talking to death about this anyways? Yeah, but I mean, he gets nervous anytime I ask him anything about Gearbox. That's so... Hey, death. What do you think of Borderlands 2, Alien Colonial Marines, and Brothers in Arms? They look like great games. I think his concerns were justified. Eh, he's just a bitch. Now that we can't get away with charging customers on this DLC, we need to find a new way to fuck over our customers. Is an unpaid intern qualified to give you any advice like this? No, but I would have to pay somebody else royalties for their input. Right, I'm a legal slave. That's right. Oh, no, I mean, um... Do, do, do we have any props left from that shitty Chun-Li story? Chun-Li story? Oh, you mean potential cash cow number 3124-B? Yes, that one. Yes, we do have some leftover props. Well, why don't we make an online live-action Street Fighter series? Brilliant! And when it comes out Blu-ray, we can include on this DLC. Whoa, 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 we're not doing that anymore, remember? Oh, shit, shit. Right, 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 right. 